That's what we need. Ready? Once Azhag comes out, then we can kill him, and then when we kill him, that grudge will go away. Oh, Azhag came out to play. And so did Grimgore. Alright, quick saving. Well, this is gonna be fun. Well, this didn't happen last time, so that's a good sign. We don't have reinforcements, we just have our army. Hey look, we have a hill though. We have a rather nice hill. Oh, we have a really nice hill. We have the most beautiful of hills. Let's get you right there. Okay. Let's see. So. <laughs> oh, oh, I will. This hill is now is my on my waifu. All right, hill. Let's see what we got. We got. You as one. You guys, you guys, your corollaries. You. Two. All of you. Three. So, let's just take group two. Nah, that's not, that's not that's not what I want. Okay, that'll be fine. We get Thorgrim right in the middle. <laughs> Over there is a ton of orcs. <laughs> You're not kidding. I will not. I will not deny that in the slightest. That is a ton of orcs. Okay. All right then. Well, <laughs> here goes nothing. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is gonna be staggered lines. Uh, how how staggered? Have multiple lines of missiles, one behind the other. Okay. Let's get these guys moved over just a bit. Um, so then we'll split it up in half. Four, five. So then if we do group four, like, here. No, if we do group four, like, here. And then... Lock formation! Shift him over just a bit. And group three. This is a reckoning! Okay. All right. I'm holding the high ground. Yeah. Well, we're gonna hold it. All right. I'm gonna let Attila tell me if this looks good first. Once once Attila gives me the all clear, then uh, then we'll do this. Let me uh, let me sit up. I was kind of reclining in my chair. That looks better. All right. Well. Here goes nothing then. Here goes nothing. 
Right. Yep. This is gonna be it. I just, as long as they don't have any rock lobbers, we should be fine. As long as we have the artillery advantage, which I think we do. Yeah, yeah, we definitely have the artillery advantage, so. I guess we just have to wait for them to come to us. If they decide to. Which they might not. I hope they do. You used AI wing groups set to always flank the enemy while controlling front infantry. That's pretty cool. Here they come. This is, yeah, this is what Total War was made for. Uh, just to quote IGN or something like that. This is the Battle of the Orc Dwarf campaign. Alright then, this is the battle. This is it. This is, this is the money shot right here. I mean, unless they don't come to me then. No. All right. I hope they're just. I hope they're just rearranging their army so that they will attack me. I'm the, there's no glory of anything. Nothing is even happening right now. They're just kind of rearranging themselves. Which I'm not a fan of. Yes, this is all thanks to Attila. Yeah. Yeah, they really aren't just... They have a lot of units. Plus two legendary lords. So I really, really hope that this happens. Yeah, I hope they're just rearranging so that they'll come attack then. They have trolls. They have all kinds of stuff. This is going to be... This is going to come down to one heck of a fight. Yeah, musket troops because they don't have... They don't have any arcing into their shots. Yeah, I guess I guess that's what they're doing. Hopefully they're just rearranging units and then they'll come attack because that's what we want. Thunderers will more or less supersede warriors on the front lines. So do you just let them shoot until they get into melee range? Is that what you're saying with Thunderers, or is it just is it just different? Um, I need some stuff towards turn the flanks. I don't have flanks. That's this is technically the outside of the map. Oh, actually, that's mm. oh. right. Is all of their stuff into place yet? No, it's not. Of course not. Aha! Okay, they come. Nice. I was wondering if this was going to happen. Thunderers are better at melee than Corollers, right? I hate trying to do that. Let's do that. Alright. Here they come. As soon as my rock lobbers start firing, I'll put it back into normal speed. You could re you could re arrange my units into a semicircle. Mm. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Anticipation rises, yeah. I mean, I could. I could rearrange my units into a semicircle, but I don't know if I want to. I don't even know how. I wouldn't even know where to begin to try to do something like that. Oh, well, actually, hold on. Let's see. So then, we want... You guys... There. I wish I could see unit paths, so that way I know where everybody's going. You know what? No. Let's not. Let's just do this. We'll just do this. It'll be fine. Hopefully it'll be fine. They have a lot of cav. Pause the game and have chat help you figure it out. Alright then. So... The problem is, is this outside boundary of the map is really far away. Like, I can't, I can't leave the hill, but I can't at the same time do anything else. Push spacebar. Oh. Oh. I didn't know that this was a thing. Okay, then. So. Aha. You guys, you guys are the best. You know that? You guys are the absolute best. Let's take these guys back a bit. Uh, let's take you actually over here to replace that. You guys a little bit longer. Okay. Put that into action a bit. Get oh, idea. So we'll take you guys. Um, we'll put you like here. And then we'll take you and y you and you. We'll put you guys like this. Maybe, maybe more like that. Okay. Alright, so let's do that. Hold Alt and click and drag to move formations. This is how I should be playing? Right, you're right. This is how I should technically be playing. Alright, let's see what we can do like this. Let's actually get you guys in. Okay, well, here goes. I ruined the two ranks, I know. But you guys were the ones who said put them in a semicircle. Alright then. This is it. This is this is this is how it ends or how it begins, who knows? They have a lot of him they have a lot of cav, but that's about it. One unit per flank is enough. Let's keep this inner strong. Nothing can stop us! Yes! Hump those dwarven legs! Plow through Kalex! Okay. Yeah, well, here's hoping. They have a they have a lot of missile units. They also have a really lot of a really high amount of cap. Alright. 
Okay, how are things going over here? I'm just pretty much gonna have to like constantly be back and forth between my lines. Let the vengeance begin. Just making sure that as soon as the unit breaks, we refocus our formations. Okay. Hard to tell. Why are you guys not shooting? No, seriously, why are you guys not shooting? Oh, okay, there they go. It's like, why are things not doing... Why are things not happening when I tell them to happen? Um... Periodically pause. Okay. Alright. Line of sight? Yeah, well, they should have a huge line of sight. You need to make that my second nature. Alright, then. So these guys are attacking. These guys are holding the line, technically. Do I need to move these side units, or do or are they fine where they are? See, I think they're fine where they are. This line of miners is breaking. We could reinforce them with that, but then those again, those are just wolf chariots. These archery units are breaking nicely, which allows our front lines to stay pretty solidified, I think. Rage, fire uh, take out them. Take out them. Take out them. Yes! Okay, another unit. Take out those, actually. These guys are fine, I guess. I'll just let them take shots. Ward. Pump up some leadership. Drop out that. That. No, kill the spider. Um, pause. Okay. Um. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So that's why I'm at. That's why I'm asking. These guys aren't doing anything. I should probably flank with them. I should honestly. I should probably flank with all of these guys. I should do like a close movement. If you'd have been me, you would have rearranged your second center range lines to support your flanks and then have them work inwards towards the center. Oh, okay. I got you. So, these are all ranged units. So, we could probably take our miners around to do a flank on both sides. So let's do that. Hopefully. Oh, wait. Let's pause. Let's make sure we're doing this right. Let's get you guys, like, he here. Here. Let's get you guys here. You guys here. And you guys back here. Well, actually, I'm going to have to go like that, and then like that. And then there. No. Here. And then here. Let's try that. Okay. Right, yeah, pausing is really good. We should do it more. Uh, kill those guys. Kill those. They're running away, kill them. Okay, we're doing fine. We're doing, we're doing just fine. Yeah, these quarrelers are doing fantastic. You guys actually could probably go with this as well. Quarrelers! 
for the current anchor and Beatrice Killers Beatrice Riddick Dull Quarrelers Vengeance Pause. Okay. They're getting attacked, but they're fine. They're good combat melee units. These guys are actually let's take you guys into melee and deal with those. Um the enemy center broke. Yeah, they're breaking nicely in the center because we've been able to keep up our we've been able to keep up our um our leadership. That's what we've been able to do. As long as our leadership is good. I actually need you guys to just go a bit more this way. Um, I actually need you guys to go just a bit more that way. Same thing with you guys, really. Let's do that. Quarrelers! For the ancestors! Strike out! Miners! Cattle! Okay. Need you guys to rearrange yourselves over here. All right. What Attila is discussing is what current today's RTS miss. If we would have kinds of formations in RTS, yeah. Right. Buff of leadership again. Ah, their sides broke. Um, nice, nice. This is awesome. This is awesome. I actually feel really good right now. Kill them. Those are going fine. Get out of melee, please. Um. Yeah, well. Look, lads, unite! Ready to serve! Yes! Vengeance! Dwarf warriors! Yes! Kazook! Kazook! Alright, um. Quarrelers are doing fine. You guys need to get here. You guys are fine. For the high you guys over here. Pause. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right. Wow, this is... Wow, look at that. We won! I'm just... I'm sitting here in awe that we actually won! Holy crap! Jeez! That's crazy! Wow! Alright! Thank you! Thank you, chat! Thank you guys so much!